Hey, this is a video for my good friend Robbie from Lily White Lane. He's um he's asked me to make him a video to quickly talk about the transfer regarding um Romano. There's a few things I would uh say, Robbie. The the first one is um Talk Sport, Sky Italia, Sky Sports, Fabrizio Romano, Ali Gold, Duncan Castle, Marka. All these different channels punching out constant breaking news or the latest uh, update with the transfer. I, I, I personally, I don't believe too much what, of, of what they say. And the reason is, unless you're Daniel Levy, Hitchin, um, Paratici, the agent or the player, you don't know what's going on. They are the only people in the know. And they might say, yep, they've got credible sources, but the people that are giving them information, apparently, are people that are leaking information they've been told in private. So you're basically a snitch. You're not, you're not a credible person if you're not keeping your mouth shut. So they're opening their mouths and telling everyone this gossip, which then gets passed on, and then these people are given these in the know. ITK1 titles, they aren't credible sources because these people aren't credible. They're leaking information that they're not allowed to leak. So I, I don't I don't buy into what the gossip is. And that's all it is. It's gossip. Unless Daniel Levy, Paratici or Hitchin come out and publicly say it, I don't think we can believe it. Uh, secondly, I feel that We've gone about our transfer business in the wrong way. It's something that I said on our uh, YouTube channel, Tottenham Away. We as a fan base are very split and divided on opinions, whether it's the money, the business, the new kits, <coughs> beg your pardon, Harry Kane coming or going, um, what, 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 what players we should get rid of, um, the one thing we do agree on as a fan base is the players we need to bring in. We need to bring in centre-backs, good ones. We need to bring in a right-back. We need to bring in a second striker. These are positions we all agree on. That's the one thing all the Spurs fans are united on, the players we need to bring in. So to go and buy a goalkeeper and a left winger when they're not the priority players and with two weeks to go before the season starts, we're now rushing around trying to get the priorities I think that just it unsettles Spurs fans. I've got nothing against us signing Brian Gill or the goalkeeper. They could both turn out to be brilliant. They could turn out to be average. Again, we don't know. Until they play, we don't know. But to not go and get the priorities first, I, I think that just upsets fans and it just it just unnerves us because it's not the kind of planning you'd expect from an ambitious club that wants to start the first game of the season against Man City and try and win it. Um... So you've got the in-the-know journalists, you've got the way we're going about our transfer business. With regards to the current social media meltdowns, I think it's because fans, including myself, we nearly got Ruben Diaz, we nearly got Dybala, we nearly got Bruno Fernandes, we could have bought Jack Grealish. We ended up buying none of them. They've all turned out to be superstars. And it's just a fear that we're about to do it again. And I think that, that fear of us missing out again, which confirms that nothing has changed at the club. It's the same transfer business as per usual. Yada, 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 blah, blah, blah. I think fans are sick of it. And, and that's why every day that goes, uh, that goes past that we don't buy Romaro, uh, Romaro, Romano, fans, they're just becoming more and more deflated that the past is repeating itself all over again. Here we go. It's Bruno... Fernandez all over again. Here we go. It's Ruben Diaz all over again. So that's difficult. Um, and the last thing I'd say is this. We have to make this deal happen. If we don't sign Romaro, I've said it again. If we don't sign Romano, <laughs> Romaro, if we don't sign Romano, Daniel Levy will come under unbelievable criticism. Questions will be asked about Paratici. What's the point of him? We don't need a director of football if he can't do his job properly. Is he even any good? 
And as a fan base, we're going to go into meltdown. And that can't happen. There's too many people whose necks are on the line with this. I don't know if he's coming. I don't know if we're going to sign him. No one knows. I hope we do because we need him and he's a top player. We have to make this signing happen. Let's see. Um, guys, please subscribe, like to Robbie's channel, Lily White Lane. Young content creator, a young Spurs fan doing really good things with his, with his life. Just dedicating it to Spurs content and YouTube. Good on him. Got a lot of time for Robbie. So um, keep it up, buddy, and come on you Spurs.